Okay, we're gonna take a look at some FRC shoulder cars or the glenohumeral joint. So, a kneeling position, butt is tight, deep breath in, pack the air down, rib is down, we're creating tension to the body. So the hand that's not gonna move, I'm gonna make a fist. I like to hold a tennis ball or an object in this hand just to help create the tension. If you don't have it, you can just hold a fist as well in this position. So I'm squeezing the tennis ball nice and hard, head is on straight. I'm gonna to start to take the arm forward, keeping elbow locked, keeping the rib down. I bring this up as far as I possibly can, okay? So keeping that rib down, keeping tension in the body. And then when I get to that end range, I'm gonna to start to internally rotate the shoulder. So I'm moving from the shoulder, internally rotating as much as I can, not letting the body twist, holding nice and tight, keep internally rotating, keep internally rotating, elbow is locked all the way down to the side. See the knuckles are facing in and the palms facing out. The shoulder is in internal rotation. We're keeping nice and tight. We reach as far back as we can now. When we hit that wall, we're gonna to start to open up. So we're gonna to start to externally rotate the shoulder, keeping the arm behind, keeping tension in the body. Nice big circle, keep rotating, keep rotating. All the way back up, back to the top position. We'll just come down to roughly shoulder height again. And then we'll do another rep. So again, keeping tension in the ball, lifting up as far back as we can without lifting the rib up, the glutes are still on. Then we're gonna to start to internally rotate the shoulder, resist the urge to twist the body, keep reaching back, keep reaching back, keep rotating through the shoulder, all the way down. So when we get to the bottom position, again, knuckles are facing me and the palm is facing out. Bum tight, reach back as far as you can. Start to externally rotate from the shoulder, Squeezing the tennis ball nice and hard. We're making the fist nice and hard. Bring it back up. And then back down to this position. I'll just show you one from the side. So same again, everything's locked. Glutes are tight. Rib is down. Nice flat back here. Squeezing the tennis ball. Moving only from the shoulder. We come up as far as we possibly can. Keep the rib down. Rotating through the shoulder. Resisting the urge to twist the torso. Keep rotating, keep rotating, keep rotating. All the way down, knuckles facing me, palm is out. Again, bum is tight, reaching back as far as we can. Start to externally rotate, externally rotate through the shoulder as much as we possibly can. Bring back up and back down into this position. Just try to imagine that there's a wall by your side and you're trying not to touch the wall. So don't get lazy in that circle and just let the arm go out to the side. As much as you can, be trying to pull the arm in, okay? You'll start to feel a good stretch through the shoulder. And just work the range of motion that you have. I'm quite mobile through my shoulders. Um, you might be quite stiff, especially if you sit at a desk all day. This is something that's gonna help to start to open up those shoulders and the rotation in that glenohumeral joint.